And then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala speaks of something important and that is jealousy. It is important for us if we'd like peace to protect our hearts from being jealous of those who are achieving things. Those who have excelled. Those who have more than us in any way. Remember jealousy. There are words in the Arabic language that describe aspects of jealousy. But the English language does not qualify to translate certain words. So let's try and do justice to it. The jealousy that is prohibited is that which you wish that Allah take away the gift he has given someone and put it on you. Or take it away from them because you don't want them to have it. That is jealousy. But if you wish for them goodness and you want to have similar goodness, that is not jealousy. It is known as ghibta. That when a person would like something good that another person has and they don't want it to be removed from that particular person. For example, you have a very wealthy man, like we said the other day. Oh Allah, this man has two million rands. Ya Allah, grant him even more and grant me three, like we said the other day. MashaAllah. So you don't want him to lose what he has. You want him also to have and you also want the same applies to a person who might have knowledge a person who might have some form of spirituality closeness to Allah you say ya Allah grant him more increase and grant myself as well more in terms of increase may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us all 